Pensana is a London listed company. Code is PRE. Uh, we are developing a large uh, magnet metal rare earth mine in Angola with potential for downstream processing in the UK. I looked at around 400 assets to invest in myself around 2018 and had a view that uh, uh, magnet metals uh, near the Indian Presidium would be in demand. And I had a view on uh, those days uh, offshore wind turbines. I thought that would be the, the go. I didn't realize that electric vehicles would uh, would be much bigger demand. So when I, I was the opportunity to look at the uh, a small exploration company in Western Australia, which had discovered this uh, rare earth deposit in Angola. And I was given the opportunity to invest in the company and, uh, and to take it forward. I, I jumped at the opportunity. So at the moment, there is a realignment of supply chains. There's real concern that China dominates the midstream of a lot of the critical minerals. You'll hear about it with lithium, certainly with rare earths, but with most others. And so from the UK perspective, we had a view that we could mine the deposit in Angola, process it to a certain point, and then using the UK's uh, chemical engineering heritage and its offshore wind, characterized by chemical parks and bad weather, we could bring this uh, high-grade material to the UK and process it into uh, uh, an oxide form. So in other words, do the midstream processing in the UK rather than sending it to China. got a number of inherent advantages. So as I mentioned, it's got these things called chemical parks and a number of them are located in major ports, which are free ports, and they're connecting directly to offshore wind. So for instance, in the Teesside and Humber, the uh, um, HVDC cables are being laid as we speak to Dogger Bank, these offshore wind farms. So we generally genuinely have chemical parks linked to renewable power. Probably where the UK is not doing as well as other countries is not providing the capital incentives for companies to invest. So we're seeing in the US, we've got a lot of capital uh, incentives through the Inflation Reduction Act. Australia, uh, Europe and other parts of the world are doing the same thing. So where the UK is not doing so well, is not putting any money into backing companies that are looking to establish midstream in the UK. much the opportunity for us to tell the Pensana story. We're close to financing at the moment, hope to be financed by the end of the year, hope to be uh, into construction. So we hope we've got some more news to share with uh, uh, shareholders and potential future investors about this uh, exciting development.